Yo, what's going on, guys? And welcome to a brand new episode of Food Sense. My name is Nickel. Thank you guys for tuning in. So today, I'm going to be going to one of the best wing spot in my city, Little Bones Wings. And it's located in Winnipeg, Manitoba, in the heart of Transcona. And I'm going to see what the hype is all about. So they have about 75 different flavors. I just placed an order. Any wings. Okay, and then we'll do, um, uh, before we start this video though, make sure you hit that subscribe button. Please drop a like and uh, share my videos if you like. All right, you ready? Let's go get it. Get it. Text a message, I don't know the number. Flexing on the is every phone and muscle. Said he taking shots and never heard the number. Even then, y'all don't worry nothing. And I'd like to give a shout out to my all right guys, we are back from Little Bones Wings and we just took out takeout. So we have the homie here, Ivan. He's gonna join me. What's up guys? And uh, we're gonna start off with some wings. So what I ordered, I should have ordered some dry wings, but all I had, actually I played wings roulette. So I went down the menu and I just picked whatever I saw or what caught my eye. So we have four saucy wings here. Um, let's start off with this one. It is the Smoked out sweet mustard. So we have smoked out sweet mustard. Yep. We have a spicy sriracha or some sort of honey. I believe that's here. And then we have the uh, parm. sweet creamy garlic parm. And then we Mexi. have the Mexi fries. I'm oh, sorry, Mexi fries. I'm so used to saying Mexi fries. We have the you Mexi wing. <laughs> As you can see, I started a little bit earlier without them. So uh, I was a little bit hungry. So. I already started. All right. So, what do you want to start off with, man? Uh, I'm gonna go with this because I always get garlic parm when we go to like wing night at Smitty's. Spicy garlic parm. Okay. This is huge. I'm gonna take this. Are you um, Are you a wing guy? Or are you a flat guy? I like both. I don't. I'm hoping this is focusing right now. If it doesn't, I apologize, guys. Yo, that's like a, a wing mashed up with a, a, a flat. That's like a wing flat. One big chunk. Okay, okay. I, got a, I got a flat here. Hopefully that focuses Put it like as right well. in the front of the camera. There you go. Alright. Okay, man. Cheers. Cheers. Mm. Very saucy. Mm. Very saucy. Huge. Very, very, I feel like the flavors are... are pretty much equal because you can taste the honey you can also taste the the parm in there it, it, it meshes pretty well right now I know all the all the uh, the breading's the same obviously and it's a hit right now I, I like the breading it's not too uh, not too much bread um, more meat and then the ends are huge I agree um, it's not like um, Compared to other wing places like Smitty's, you can't really taste the. Uh, sometimes they use the old oil, and you can you can taste the old oil. This one seems fine to me. I haven't tasted any old oil yet, but uh, we have three more to go. So, we'll. Uh, what do you want to try out next? Let's go for the uh, honey sriracha. Is this honey? What is it? Honey sriracha. It's, it's something sriracha. So it's either honey sriracha or spi it's spicy honey sriracha or something like that. I'm not too sure. Um, yeah, let's, let's try it. Let's go for I'll it. I'll go for a flat this time. Let's see if that focuses. Again, if it doesn't focus, we apologize for the blurriness, but yeah. All right, cheers. It has like a. This one has a lemony taste to it. You feel like it's a lemon. I feel like it has like um like an Asian sweet chili, sweet chili vibe to it. No. Mine. Yeah, lemony with uh, the sriracha taste, sriracha flavor. Okay. Yep. You can definitely. T it hits you with the lemon first, and then the sriracha kicks in in the back. Mm -hmm. After. Um, again, well proportioned wing. Um, I like how it's very meaty. Um, not too much breading, so that's that's a plus. It's 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 saucy. It's a little saucy. I wish we had um, dry wings so we could compare the sauciness to the dry. But um, this one I'm a fan of. It's pretty good. Yeah. 
Yeah, I like it. So smash or a pass with the honey and garlic parm. That's a smash right there. Smash, Kate, okay, we're gonna smash with that. Smash or a pass with the honey, sriracha, whatever you wanna call it, spicy honey, sriracha. That's a smash as well. Smash as well. All right, so we're two for two, guys. Two smashes, we got two more to go. And uh, what do you wanna start off with? That one or this you, one? You choose this one. Okay, let's go for the Mexi. Let's go for the Mexi wings. I like how the cheese is just melted on top. That really good presentation. You know? Can't wait to bite in. Ooh, look at that. Okay, do a close up. Look at all that cheese, guys. Look at all that cheese. Looks like there's uh, mozzarella and cheddar. You know what it reminds me of? A nachos. I guess that's what they were going for, like nachos, Mexi fry style. Well, it's Mexi wings, so. That's a lot of cheese, bro. I like this part. Okay, go for it. This one's more of the drier side too, so. Looks like it, it is like a dry rub, just with the cheese melted. Like chili powder is just uh, sprinkled on top, and then they melt the cheese. With green onions, what else? With sour cream in there. Sour cream, yeah. Yeah. Jala Wait, is it jalapeno? No, I don't see any jalapenos in here. So it's pretty much like nachos, yeah. restaurant style. Um, Self-explanatory Mexi fries. It's not bad, sorry, it's good. Mexi nachos. Do you normally go out for wings? Yeah, with you. <laughs> wing nights are usually Tuesdays, on Thursdays, I guess Wednesdays now. I guess every day is good night. By the way, we're drinking sparkling water. Try to cut down on the pop. I wanted beer, but uh, there was no beer. Do you have beer? Just no beer. It's pretty good, actually. Watermelon. Watermelon. I'd say this is my least favorite. Okay. Right. Uh. Like, say you're getting nachos at a pub, same thing, just with chicken. So, would you, is that a smash or a pass? I say it's a smash for presentation, because you just want to eat it. But, taste-wise, I'm going to pass, uh, just because it's just a flavor I've had many times. I agree, so the presentation very nice it makes it look cool it's Instagram worthy so it's IG worthy if you want to flex on your IG story definitely take a picture of the maxi wings um, and it's also the, the sizes of the wings so that's what I like about it because they're mm -hmm. pretty decent size I mean if you just order this then you'll you'll pretty you'll get pretty full um, I think one of these can get you full yeah that's why I asked you to come eat with me because I don't think I could finish all of this um, they're pretty because you know you go out to Smitty's or you want to go out to a different wing place, you always get that little tiny wing. Yeah. And I like to say it's not even a wing, it's like the chicken's nose. <laughs> <laughs> um, okay, yeah, the presentation is nice. It's good. I, I would say these two are the best presentation. Um, Taste-wise, there's nothing, I mean, it's, 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 it's pretty, I would like to say nacho basic, but uh, so presentation I'll pass as well. Um, Taste-wise, uh, sorry, presentation I'll smash. And then, taste-wise, a pass. So two smashes, one pass. Two smashes, one pass for me. And what about you? Same. Okay. So the the scorecard's even right now, and uh, we have one more left, and that is the. Is it hot mustard? What is it? The hot. I know it has mustard in it. Um, something mustard. It is the uh, smoked out sweet mustard. So smoked out sweet mustard. I mean, the name's pretty dope. All right, go for it. I'll take a smaller piece here. It's very saucy as well. Ooh, this is a drum. All right, I'll, I'll put it on there. Let's see if you guys can get that. Hopefully you can. All right, final, final bite. Cheers. Cheers. The breading is good. 
it's not too much. I like this one. It's very tangy. Sweet and tangy. With a little uh, sour kick to it. Are you a fan of mustard? I am. Did you know, have you ever had a Chicago dog before? No. So, Chicago dogs, it's like a gourmet hot dog, but you're not allowed to put ketchup on it. It's just, they top it out with mustard. It's pretty bomb. But if you're not a mustard guy, then you definitely, th this wing's not for you. Um, that reminds me of when I was a kid, I used to eat corn dogs, and I'd only mm. eat it with mustard. I like corn dogs, but I eat it like once every few years, just because something about the breading. I think there's too much breading. It depends what you get. Yeah, I haven't had that in years. Is it like the pogo one? or Yeah, pogo. Okay, so what is it? The, the mustard, the honey mustard wings, is that going to be a smash or a pass? That's a pass for me. Oh, no, sorry, a smash. I, I do like it. You like it? Yeah. All right, I'm going to have to, to smash as well. Um, <laughs> very saucy. Um, the breading is good, well, well proportioned size as well. But it's very flavorful, so you get, um, that's what I like about these wings here, the, the flavors. They're really, all different. They're all different. Same size, they all look too saucy, but when, once you take a bite, the flavors will hit you all at once. Um, very flavorful, which I like in a wing. Okay, so what would you say out of these four? I guess rank them for your top four. All right, top four. So I'm going to go with the, the garlic parm or the honey garlic parm as my number one pick. Then I'm going to go with my number two pick would be the sriracha honey, whatever you want to call it. Then I'm going to go with the mustard with the third pick. And last place goes to the maxi fries. Um, but presentation wise, Mexi fries, or sorry, I keep saying Mexi fries. The Mexi wings, <laughs> the Mexi wings is gonna be last place, but number one presentation. Me, I'm gonna go, uh, I'm gonna go with this first. All the right. garlic, garlic parm, and then the hot, or the sweet mustard, then the sriracha, and then the Mexican. Mexican. All right, there you guys have it. This is only four flavors. Apparently, Lil Bones wings have, you have 75. Um, 75 plus. So we have 73 to go. <laughs> so, what, so how many 70? Oh, sorry, 71. <laughs> Yo, we're Asians, man. We're, we should be good with math. So we, they, we have like 71 more flavors to go. Um, Lil Bones, hit us up if you want us to do more wing reviews. <laughs> this is not, uh, what is that called? not a promo but uh, always wanted to try your wings it's not, um, sponsored. it's not sponsored that's what you want to say all right well that brings up and we're gonna finish the rest of the wings and uh, that brings up the end of this video hope you guys enjoyed it um, shout out to little bones wings um, decent review what uh, would you give it out of 10 uh, I would give it a well they're not they're not hot. I mean, we did take our time, but if they were hot, I would give it probably... Like fresh hot? They're in takeout to containers too. I could imagine that if they were just fresh off the uh, fryer, then it would be yeah. a different taste. So out of I 10? I would give these an 8.5. 8.5, okay, cool. I gave it a solid 8 out of 10 um, for Little Bones Wings. There you have it. Um, if you're new to my channel, make sure you hit the subscribe button. Uh, this is the homie Ivan Solomon. Follow him on Instagram and uh, at me at Instagram too as well, Food Sense or Nickel Mac. Make sure you smash that like button and uh, comment down below if you want us to try uh, any other local spots. All right, this is Food Sense. Peace. Now let's hope that I'm in the. That we're both in the frame. Let's both. Let's hope we're both in the frame, bro. Oh, it was almost 15 minutes too.